So I really didn't want to have to make this video, but there are going to be some news articles coming out later this week about some stuff related to me and the farm. And to be quite honest, I'd rather have you guys hear it from me versus somewhere else. So here it goes. Good morning, large white farm dog. How are you guys doing, huh? Oh, no. Hi, Abby dog. Hi there, sweetie. Hello, Mr. Toby dog. How are you doing, buddy? All right, let's go. Come on, we've got chores to do. Inside. So over the past couple of years, there have been a number of scandals where there are YouTubers. What the hell? Guys. No way. Who pretend to be one thing. My wife and I, we live off grid in a log cabin on 11 acres. We grow 90% of our own food. But it turns out they're an entirely different thing. Today we're gonna be looking at individuals who script reality in order to achieve virality. And they've been faking out you, the viewing public. Something's really got the dog's attention. I was just looking over there, like towards the road over in the woods behind me. And I think I saw a little bit of movement. So there was some sort of animal out there. And that's why Toby Dog and Abby Dog just started barking like crazy. What is it, buddy? Of course, I can't let myself get distracted because I clearly don't want to talk about this one. I do owe you guys an explanation. Because over the years, there have been a number of people who have said that our farm is not a real farm. He's really sly. The Bible warns us about people like him. That this is all just fake and for show. And some people even saying that I'm actually just an actor and not really a guy named Morgan Gold. Looks like I got two goose sharing the same nest. Excuse me, girl, I need to get up. Release the Kraken! Alright, Miss, I'm gonna need to get in here. Thank you. <laughs> that silly goose was guarding two wooden eggs. Ooh, another void egg. All right, girl, I'm kicking you out. Come on. Out you go. Up. Oh. Come on. Miss, excuse me. Out you go. It looks like she only had one egg going here. And then we got one of the runner duck eggs too. My children are gone. <laughs> You working on anything yet? Is there anything there? Nope, not yet. All right, you keep doing your job. And so anyway, back to the point of this video. There is this reporter out there right now and she's working on a story about our farm. In her story about our farm, she asserts a number of things that this is not a real farm. I am an actor, my wife is an actor. And everything you see around here as Goldshaw Farm is actually just an elaborate set piece. And so I've decided to come on to this video today to address those allegations and tell you guys that those allegations are 100% true. Yes, I am not really a farmer named Morgan Gold. I'm actually an actor and my name is Kevin Finnerty. The woman who plays my wife, Allison, is also just an actress. You can actually see her IMDV movie profile over there. And yes, this entire farm is actually fake. In fact, 
All it is is just a green screen and a whole lot of computer graphics going on here. I mean, yeah, like, I don't even know why I'm wearing this coat right now. It's kind of ridiculous, isn't it? Like, there's no reason to be dressed up anytime. Because all of our videos are shot indoors. And the Goldshaw Farm videos, they're actually all produced on a soundstage in Hoboken, New Jersey. You see, a few years back, I hired some really talented computer animation folks, and that's how all of the things that you typically see are created. And while this technology is absolutely not new, I mean, just look at the Star Wars prequels and how they produce those things. It has become more sophisticated over the years, and that's really how we're able to do everything. And I know that this is going to break a lot of your hearts, but both Toby Dog and Abby Dog are fake. All of the ducks, geese, and chickens are fake. Remember, you guys, birds aren't real. Birds are real! In fact, the only animal on our farm that's actually real is Lil Barn Cat. And she does happen to be the cat who hangs around the studio here. You see, she showed up in a shot on a live stream once. And so I just kind of made up a backstory and went with it. If you really go back and look at our videos, she never appeared in any videos prior to January of 2021, which was when we had that little snafu in the live stream during a farm meeting. But what is real is, is that she is as adorable as she is. But the whole story about getting hit by a car that I put out in a video last week, I mean, that was all fake. I mean, heck, even look at these x-rays, right? Look at that. That's just bad Photoshop. Now, I know that this news might be shocking for many of you and completely changes how you feel about our farm. But I actually think that there's going to be a good number of you folks who kind of suspected this all along. And much like the fans of pro wrestling can distinguish between real life and kayfabe, I do hope there are folks out there who continue to watch our videos. And for just one day and one day only today, I'm going to be inside the comments answering any questions you guys might have. Feel free to get as detailed as possible. I will try to give you my best and most honest answers. But then that's it. After today, I am not going to be confessing anything anymore. And I'm going to go back to having the farm show be like the farm show is. And all I can do is hope that you guys continue to watch. And probably not read that article that's going to come out next week.